At least 17 people have been injured after twin S-300 Russian missiles struck the Ukrainian city of Kharkiv. Well, this is Tuesday's raid which has caused severe damage to residential buildings in the area. Scrambling rescuers were seen sifting through the rubble to find the injured. As per the regional police, the assault happened in areas with no military infrastructure. The first strike struck a roadway while the other one, a three-story apartment building close to the building, a fire also broke out on two floors of a hospital which was later extinguished. The city's mayor has said that 12 people, including two women, have been hospitalized earlier on Tuesday. At least 3,000 people were made to evacuate the city's front owing to the Russian aggression. Just last week, a hotel was struck in the city, which injured at least 11 people. Meanwhile, Washington's military assistance for Ukraine has dried up. U.S. President Joe Biden will table talks with congressional leaders over continuing aid for Ukraine later today. The Republicans have blocked $60 billion of aid over the Biden administration's handling of the border migrant crisis. During a presser, French President Emmanuel Macron said that France will deliver 40 long-range missiles to Ukraine. This week, Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky met key U.S. officials at the Davos Forum to discuss aid. The leader also met with NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg. The Kremlin dismissed the talks and rejected any plan that does not let Russia keep the conquered territory. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.